<laughs> Nearly six months after Oxenfree 2 Lost Signals was released, Tina finally stopped testing choices and consequences for a moment to edit her first playthrough. The day's finally here. Will she get startled, <gasps> make weird noises, <laughs> and possibly cry? Yes, because what you just saw were clips from the actual footage. <laughs> if you haven't played or watched Oxenfree 1, stop what you're doing now and do so. While this sequel stands alone, it's much more powerful if you've obsessed over it for years and years before experiencing. But in summary, a boat, triangles, spooky ghosts, time loops, and a deep bond with Alex, Jonas, Nona, Ren, and Clarissa as they save the world while potentially saving themselves. I think we're all accounted for. Now let's play the sequel, Oxenfree 2 Lost Signals. I am so excited right now. I am so excited right now. I have been waiting for this for a very long time, but not as long is the amazing people that discovered this game when it first came out. For me, it was only a, like a year ago and I knew a sequel was coming out and it's just, it's, I'm just so excited. And I'm so in depth with testing out all the dialogue and everything for the first um, Oxenfree that I um, have, have just been really invested in this game for, for this whole time. I'm like, can't even talk because I'm so excited right now. I guess I just have to start. It's been so long, I feel weird like starting the game, you know? Oh my God, the eyes. <gasps> Player choice is a central feature of Oxenfree 2 Lost Signals. The game contains playable scenarios which may cause mental and emotional discomfort. Play with care and visit nightschoolstudio.com content warning for a list of potentially sensitive game content. I've been actually staying away from most of the trailers, from spoilers, from anything, so I don't really know much. Okay, so here's our possible achievements. Agreed to be a special kind of friend. <laughs> what? Letters? More letters? Okay, here we go. I like seriously like can't even start. That's so funny. When I was playing the first one, I also had a really hard time starting. But it was because I didn't think I was gonna like it. And now it's completely the opposite. Like I'm so excited that I can't start playing it. Oh, that's like so funny. <sighs> Oxen free too. <laughs> okay, wait. This is serious. This is dramatic. It's likely scary or spooky rather um so i can't be too excited i need to be like chill <laughs> i don't think that's gonna be possible <gasps> save files oh oh that's great well i guess i don't know if you can load scenes if you can load scenes that's great for me <laughs> oh because you know i'm gonna wanna go nuts with the figuring out of stuff. Okay. Silent. So silent. Okay, I see a little loading bar at the bottom now, so something's happening. Very slowly. Is it broken? It's speeding up. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's a really tiny loading bar at the bottom, but it's definitely helpful so you know things are working properly. happening there's no sound what's that oh it's you again, again. Oh, what what do you want it's alex you know jonas where did you is leave possible who's that is that oh i i teared up Oh my god, we're starting already. How'd I get here? Hello, anyone here? Am I dreaming? Okay, now I'm playing on a PlayStation, so those are the buttons. Um, uh, how did I get here? How, how, wait, wait, wait. I, I, I totally here? teared up. Am I, is this another? <sighs> another? I mean, that's a new character, right? Unless that's like, Alex grown up or something. Up. Riley? Riley, are you 
Riley. Riley? Riley, come in, Riley. Okay. Riley, please answer. Who's this? Yes. What do you want? Uh, okay. Who? Who is this? Riley. I don't know. Oh yeah, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure. Get back. Hello, who's dangerous? Who's dangerous? Who are you? Who is dangerous? I don't know where I'm going. I don't know if I should go up there. Okay. Is this a plaque to tell me what's happening? dare open that door. I I guess I need shelter right now. Okay, there's like graffiti. What are those letters? And what is that? Does that say me too at the bottom? I can't tell what that says. I'm gonna need to like zoom into that later. Huh. Guess we're going in. Oh, I didn't look down at the bottom. Okay. This place looks deserted, obviously. No one would work like this. I don't think this thing's operational. That looks like one of the radios in Oxenfree 1, or the, like, the command radios, or what, I forget what they're called at this point. Um, kind of looks just like it. Okay, I guess we're going up. <laughs> oh, that's new. I was trying to push up. Okay. So you, like, say that you want to go on the ladder and then then you go. Sometimes. Um, anyone uh, is there? anyone up there? Nobody answered. What is that? What is that? What the hell? What the hell is... I'm with you, Riley. I don't, do I want to go on top of it? Can I, I can't go down, oh, I can. Well, I guess we're here. Enter, enter the thing, the scary thing. I would not enter it in real life. Maybe this is a dream. Do I know you? Um, I think... Uh, do we know each other? I think, so maybe... Bury me. <gasps> Where you can't see one. Oh! Come in, <gasps> Riley. If you're there, pick up, please. What? Riley, answer, please. Over. I'm sorry, whoever you are. I need a second to process. I understand how to are you there? pick up the walkie. I Riley. just need a second it's to process what just happened. Okay, I got it. Need a second. Riley! Oh my are god! You in the bathroom. <laughs> no! Just get the thing on the on the side. Okay, hit it. Yeah, I'm here. Sorry, I dozed off. Not uh, that none of that is true. Fine. Yeah, yeah, sorry. I'm here. I think I dozed off for a second. I think hey, I was processing. Hi. That's okay. Uh, I'm just glad you picked up and that the walkie's working. Okay. I'm Evelyn, an environmental researcher with the lab. Oh. Uh, welcome to your first day on the job. Thank I'm you. sure Leslie went over this stuff with you already during training and orientation, so forgive me if I repeat a few things. You're just uh, going to be planting transmitters along the coast to help us study anomalous frequencies. Okay. First of all, can you hear me okay? Over. Okay, yes, we can hear you. So we are planting transmitters Riley, to study an how are you anomalies. Me? Oh my god. Uh, maybe you walked into a bad zone. Do we have her number? No? Okay. Leslie probably told you we're an environmental group. Local governments will contract us to study the effects of deforestation or noise pollution. Okay. But my specific area of expertise is in strange or otherwise unique natural phenomena electrogravity, cool. ion winds, you know, stuff like that. Great. 
Now, over the last few months, Kamina's been overrun with disruptions in the electromagnetic spectrum. These frequencies act like radio waves, but as far as we know, aren't. And they're messing with the town's comm equipment, TV stations, even air traffic signals. The transmitters you'll place will relay any signals back to us so we can study them. Got it? Um, Over. hold on. You're going to tell me to go fast. I'm going to pause. So <laughs> our job is to, it's our first day apparently, and we're planting transmitters to help basically relay the messages to whatever this headquarters is maybe so they can study them. It seems like radio waves, but something's up with them. I think we know what they are. If uh, you've played Oxenfree 1 or watched my playthrough, they're ghosts. <laughs> At least, we think. I think I read that this is five years after the Edwards Island Oxenfree 1 took place. Although there are time, you know, continuum issues going on. So who knows if that's actually accurate. I'm avoiding trying to start over again three times. So I want to make sure I get what's going on as we go. Because I'm too excited to pay attention sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Makes sense, Riley? Uh, no, let's, let's Sorry, just Sorry, Evelyn, can you go over that again? This is about radio signals? Yeah, it, yeah, it, it's all a little strange, right? Yeah. You're going to be placing transmitters around the coastline of Kamina to study electromagnetic phenomena. Kamina's recently been flooded with, as of yet, untraceable signals that have been interfering with electronic equipment. Yeah. We have some theories, but these transmitters will provide us the data we need to figure out what's happening. Sound okay. good? Yep. Your transmitters and climbing gear for the rocky terrain are being held with the very polite manager of the general store. Should be right in the center of the harbor. Go get them and then call okay. me back. Okay? Oh, oh, and before I forget, uh, you have a walkie-talkie. Uh, You'll be using it to we keep in contact on it. with me and anyone else you need to chat with. <gasps> the boat! Uh, do you need me to go over the basics of how to use it? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm... Yeah, no, I like need a refresher. Yeah, I need I, to know. I could the actually boat. use a refresher if you don't mind. Not a problem. Okay, I need to listen. Not a problem. So go ahead and look at your walkie. There okay. are a lot of channels, as you can see. I'll always be on channel oh. seven. So if you ever want to chat, just click over to that and say hi. But uh, let's let's hop over to channel five so you can see it working. Okay. Oh. Oh yeah. Hey, I'm Evelyn. Here. I'm here. Be there. Perfect. I'm your night watch, so I'll be on all night unless I'm using the bathroom or <laughs> taking a bug outside or something. Uh -huh. All right, let, let, let's switch back to seven so we're not crowding anyone else who could be using this channel. See you on seven. Cool. Hey, Evelyn, I'm back on seven. Oh, there's Over. a general search. Great. Hey, hi. So, uh, everything about the walkie-talkie makes sense? Yeah. Makes total sense. You're a good teacher. Uh, over. Oh, thanks. I try to be. Well, nice to meet you, Riley, even if not in person yet. Let me know when you got your gear, okay? okay. General store. Okay, over and out. Bye. What is this? Can I look at the sign? No. This building looks like Lewis and Clark could have slept here, but the uh, security's new. Maybe it's a meeting house now or something? <gasps> oh, it's locked. locked. That makes sense. It's after dark. It's usually when you lock things. Okay, can we... Wait, what's the walkie? Okay, I wanted to ask Evelyn about it. But maybe, I guess this is sort of like the tutorial portion, so maybe I'm overthinking things right now. We just got to go to the general store and get our gear. There you are. Let's get some gear. What'd you say? Climbing stuff? Huh. It doesn't look like anyone's here. Uh, I should probably call Evelyn and let her know. I thought we were going to go on like a key finding mission or something. What is this? A flyer? Learn about our free soul body health class. Luna has the power to heal. Join parentage. Keep to the stars, blood, moon, tide. Huh. Okay, so that is what I know about with parentage. It's a cult. But okay, you didn't hear that from me. Because uh, I don't want to give it away if you didn't know that already. Hey, Evelyn. Is there like another general store nearby? Because there's nobody here, so... I don't know what to do. Over? Ah, oh, crud. Okay. You must have closed early. This isn't a deal breaker, though. Just head up the hill on your way to Camber Cape. Your partner, Jacob Summers, is having some car trouble, but he's got a transmitter you both can use for tonight. Over. Okay. 
partner, what about the climbing gear? Yeah, what about the oh, climbing gear? Uh, okay, uh, but what about the climbing gear? Don't I, uh, don't we need that? Well, if Jacob gets his truck fixed, that'll help mitigate the need. But regardless, we'll have you do a simple okay. one tonight that doesn't require climbing. Tomorrow you can start on the bad boys. Oh. Sorry, Riley. Uh, one sec. Okay, wait. Maybe I, I can now be right. on the thing. Let me go over to the gate. Those um, readings don't make sense. Hey, oh. uh, Evelyn, is everything all right? Ghosts. Evelyn. I'm sorry, Riley, I gotta go. But uh, real quick, you have your map with you, right? Pull it out I, for a second. I don't know. Oh, okay. So, Ooh. as you can see, there's a lot of land to cover. Uh, and yeah, there is. Inaccessible unless you have climbing gear. All those rocks and cliffs and crap are too dangerous without rope and anchors. But Jacob's still at Copper Creek Trail, northwest of where you're at right now. This is huge. Dude, I had troubles with the map on Oxenfree 1. What am I going to do now? Oh, okay. So we can pan in and we can zoom around. So we are just in this little section. And Jacob's up there. Okay, so we need to go up to the top. Okay, there's a little yellow arrows where we can exit. Also, by the way, your map has a lot of useful information. Okay. Don't be afraid to whip it out if you ever get lost or forget what you're doing. Never okay, be afraid I'll to whip it out. Ew, Jacob. no, that's not Thanks, true. Riley. Over and out. <laughs> I mean, I meant that to be, you know, like an innuendo, but also, like, no, that wasn't a good pairing sentence to say with that statement. Okay, so, uh, there's a lot of things to look at. Closed. Back Wednesday. Are you kidding? Do we know what day it is? Did it say? I know it said 8 p.m. I don't think it said what day it was. Okay, so I'm assuming I'm going up. Camber Cave. Some of these postings are pretty old. God, 20 bucks an hour for a babysitter? If she doesn't fly through the chimney with a school of singing penguins, that's a total ripoff. Yeah, $3. I remember when I babysat as a 12 year old, it was $3 an hour, $1 each additional kid. Definitely, times have changed. Copper Creek Trail. I could probably look at the map, but uh, I'm gonna wing it. So another thing I heard is that the music is adaptive to your choices, which is pretty cool. Um, or the mood of what's happening in the story, essentially. So, you know, related to your choices, the mood that, that it creates based on your choices in some areas. So that's really exciting. Rather than it just playing, you know, a certain track. Okay. Okay, so if I go down, that's the Uptown Harbor. Okay, I'm just trying to get an idea of how this map works early on. So you don't run into issues. Famous last words. Jacob down there. No, that's Let's look at a bulletin board first. Or a poster. Right size, no. Missing. Lucy Pasterson, oh, age seven, seven, born 1979. This has been up for a while. <sighs> Hope you ran away to California, kid. I don't think she did at seven years old. Nope, nope Jacob, I'm going this way first. Okay, so highway. I just want to see, just to get a gauge, huh, okay. Where the hell is that stupid kid? Yeah, let's talk to you. Jacob Summers, I'm your partner, Riley. Let's find out if it's him hey, first. Uh, sorry, but are you- Oh, map updated Jacob. now. Jacob Summers. Oh, hey, yeah, I, I'm Jacob, which makes you uh, Riley. Riley. Yeah. Evelyn let me know you were on the way. Uh, you, you, you kind of caught me in the middle of, <laughs> This is embarrassing. I can't get my truck to start. That's not embarrassing. Yeah, this yeah, don't it be was going to be our ride around town for the job, but. Oh, God, don't be embarrassed. It's not your yeah, fault, right? Not at all. Or maybe it is. You know it takes gasoline in the little hole over there, right? Oh, that's what that meter with all the slashes means. Seriously, though, I have <laughs> no idea. Can we can we try something real quick? Uh, the keys in the what kind of thing? Could you just start up the engine real quick? 
trying to see if it's the uh, starter or the battery. Uh, yeah, we can help. Sure. What the hell? Oh, thanks. <gasps> it's just bubbles. I don't know what the issue is. Yay! Some of the electronics bubbles. have been blinking when it was on. He has an opinion of us as some kind, favor favorably or unfavorably. Oh, crap. Oh, oh okay. that's not good. Turn, turn it off. Yeah. Oh, I feel like I could smell well, it. Thanks. You're I won't even try to sorry. explain what happened. Oof. Sorry, dude. That sucks. Ah, it's all right. She gave me eight crappy years, which was more than I expected. Okay. Anyway, you help me out. I think we can call time of death on this one. Aww. She is Evelyn. Evelyn. Yes! Chill! Oh, I think that's our uh, boss is doing a check-in. Want to answer that? Hmm. Nah. Riley, are you there? Pick up, please. Evelyn, Over. just wait. I'm trying to get things done. I'm bonding with my new partner. Please. It's just the, uh, the, button the, the button. Push. Yeah, the clicker well, thing on the side there. Okay. Always channel uh, seven for the Riley research and lab. Jacob. Here hey, again. Evelyn. Yeah, you got Riley and Jacob here. Over. Okay, great. Hi, Jake. Jake's great. He's a handyman regularly, but we were lucky to get his help with this. Your truck ready? You guys good to go? Jacob wrecked his truck. The truck died. Uh, Give us a sorry. second. Sorry, you go by Jacob. I just, I, I know a Jake, so it's muscle memory. No, it's, I don't it's feel fine. like we need to lie. Uh, not yet, Evelyn. Jacob's truck was struck down by a mysterious illness. I think the engine's fried. Is our first transmitter yeah, point far? Over. Uh, kinda. It's Camber Cape. We want to try and get as much over air traffic as we can. I Is it see far now climb, why like you a asked mountain? if I had an all terrain vehicle. We don't have Wait, our climbing a gear. Bit of a climb? Like we're scaling a mountain or a really big hill or what? It's, it's more like a steep hike. You two are going to be planting transmitters all around Kamina. Hmm. Jacob, you have transmitters, right? Uh, just one. Riley, I'm strapped for space, so, uh, could you grab the transmitter? Okay. Oh, uh, okay. This thing? I think I have the space. I promise I won't think of you as our pack mule. But why even say that? What am, I, am I taking it out and just holding it? Huh. Neat. Oh. Okay. One tonight and a few more tomorrow when I guess the general I am. store opens. <laughs> Ooh, transmitter acquired. Hmm. Okay, guys, I feel good about this. Really. Jacob, Riley, have any questions? Um, explain the job again. Do I need dinner? a partner? Nope, no questions. Uh, no. I don't think I have any questions, no. All right, guys, good luck. Let me know if you run into any trouble or have any future questions. Okay. I'll be on most of the night. Over and out. Thanks, thanks Evelyn. Talk thanks. to you later. All right, Evelyn. Uh, thanks. Appreciate it. Bye. Oh, uh, Riley, real quick before we go. You see that radio on my truck? Uh, can you grab oh. it? A radio? Sorry, but I, I kind of got my pockets full. Why the radio? Is this for work? Uh, if sure. If you don't mind. You want to bring a radio? I, I want to know why. planning on listening to music along the way? Or? Uh, no. Uh, there's lots of kind of cool stuff we can do with it. Jacob, let it's me right tell there. you a little something about Oxen Free One. I don't think this is a good idea. I'm just saying. It'd be a help since you have the backpack. I, I know, Jacob. I know. You, Riley, do you see the radio? I, you have great intentions, Jacob. I'm sure. It's uh, kind of important that we take it. Is it important or are you just trying to... Uh... We have huh. the radio. Thanks. Hey, try it out. This far from town, we won't get the whole range, but okay. I think we can get the uh, local baseball game. Tune it to 93.7. Um, okay. Uh, yeah, okay. Just give me a sec. In the cheap seats, this is David Bottom of the now 10 okay, the I've heard this. I won't tell you how just yet, but I I have used to watch crayfish games with my older brother like 20 years ago. But uh, thanks. It, it sounds great. I wonder if we know his brother. Okay, by foot, Camber Cape is up this way. Shouldn't take too long. Interesting. So, uh, Evelyn. I'm curious. 
She's she's a little funny, right? Oh, it's like constantly playing. Interesting. She ran so me through the job a week ago. like pick up where it left off. It's like a real radio. Okay, I'm not character. paying attention. Um, like how? Oh, funny? Like how do you mean? I, I I don't even know. She's just. I mean, her voice has a thing to it. You know, she's a, a character. I if mean, I she, hear her at a like, train station or something, I'll immediately know that's Evelyn. Yeah, I don't know that I feel that way. Hey, uh, this is a really stupid time to bring this up, but but when I heard your name, Riley, I you thought of life is well, strange. Do, do you remember junior year? This is Osmore's English class. And, oh, uh, the fifth period. We, we went to high school together. No way. I did a new friend, uh, uh, Patty. Peanut butter Peanut Patty. Peanut butter Patty. We ran in different circles, but I just wanted you to know that I knew we knew each other. That's Interesting. all. Interesting. Good to see you. Yeah, yeah. No, of course. Good, good to see you. Don't yeah, worry. you too. So, uh, hi, I'm Jacob. Nice to meet you. Uh, first day on the job topics. I'm what you call an independent contractor. You know, light yeah. fixtures, building a deck. Sure. But I signed up for this partly because of how weird everything's been. It, it's, it's why I brought the radio, actually. Evelyn won't get into it, but you um, can tune into super strange stuff if you know how to find it. You could tune into super strange stuff. Evelyn won't get into it. What super strange stations seem normal to me? No. Super okay. strange stuff? I, like more than just foreign stations bouncing off a satellite here, somewhere? Uh, yeah. Hmm. Way more. It used to happen just on Edwards Island. It was a sort of inexplicable audiovisual phenomenon. Yeah. Using any old radio, you could tune into physical objects. Yeah. I'm curious if we'll get objects? readings from What's the Edwards island. I, I wanted him to talk more about okay, Edwards remind Island. Remind me, what's so special no, about Edwards wanna... Island? Isn't it like a tourist trap? Oh, yeah, it was. Still is, kind there. of. But people aren't really allowed there anymore. The hours are really limited. Oh. But uh, it was Fort Milner for decades, an old World War era bunker yeah, in military base. There's a lot of stories. But yeah, anyways, the effects, though, that radio effects has kind of bled from the island to around here now. Oh, but I, I'm sorry. I'm just into this stuff. Super nerd techie. OK, I think that's the end of the conversation. But I just I've been talking oh. my head off ever <laughs> since we've been. God, OK, what's uh, what brought you back? Um, did you go up here? My dad's not doing is, well. Is it temporary or? Um, my dad isn't okay. doing too great. I just want to see if the um, conversation continues. Back, you know, if it doesn't, that would be for sad. A while. Oh, we got a speech close to him. Okay. Sort of did. Will she continue talking about her dad now? Because if it skips it, I want to know right away so that I make sure I don't go to new locations until like all conversations exhausted. But then that might take a really long time. But you know, I gotta finish it. I gotta. Please, please continue. Oh, sorry, that, that's, um, that, that's, that's too bad. Okay, it continued. I, I didn't mean to bring up bad news, but that's really nice of you to come back. I, I mean, for him, I'm sure he appreciates it. We're not that close. Yeah, well, a, what's uh, your story? A thorny I hope bush. he appreciates And I've it. never said that before in my life. Mm, well, what's, sure. what's your story? Jacob the Handyman? There's gotta be more than that, right? Um, to be perfectly honest, not much more. Oh. I'm a tinkerer. I like to tinker. Me too. Not in the super villain way, but you know. What's over here? Anything fun? Hmm. I, I wanna like bust out the radio a little bit. Oh, that's the, okay, that's the walkie. Hopefully, it's, it's been a tough season. Uh, okay, I'm done. Uh, pure poetry or not my own, but here you go. Weird crap in the sky, and it might be disrupting broadcasts, so... Back soon? Hopefully? Pray for clear skies. 91.4, the pot line. <laughs> oh! High school radio station with your fearless host, Maria Lopez. I'm pulling the overnighter tonight because hey, Kyle, my partner in crime, got sick. Or... Hello. Okay, so that's the radio. This evening's theater of the air dramatic reading. These half-hour performances Ooh. of one-act plays are sponsored by Headley Textiles. We'll see how that develops later. Oh, can I? Oh, we gotta climb over <sighs> it. Ugh. My hip flexor is gonna be mad at me tomorrow. <laughs> oh, another bulletin board. Let's check it out. Oh my god, this is so huge. 
Wapiti Trail, day hiking and biking only, sunrise to sunset. Wapiti means deer. Okay. Just um, in case you didn't know. Let's not be mean to him. Oh. Uh, interesting. I don't know. Maybe that's not a good thing. Maybe he that like would show him that we're smart. Okay, so we can go to the trail. Place first transmitter at Camber Cave. Okay. I'm just going all the way to the top. Can't believe I'm finally playing this. Ah, uh, 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 slow up. Be careful around those logs. Sometimes it rains and stays <laughs> slick overnight. But you seem okay. Yep, we're good. <laughs> you overslip? Sounds like there's a an anecdote there. <laughs> no. Well, I it once. Twice, but ne never seriously hurt. Well, okay. once seriously yeah. hurt, but okay. I'm fine. I want like more information on that. What's this? Exactly. Oh, that? Radio? We have some off-color people living this far out from proper civilization. Okay. There's a group in town that performs uh, nature rituals. You'll see evidence of it dotted around. Okay. This could be them. All right. Oh. Really tight area, huh? And <laughs> they're so Oof. cute. Uh, these parts always a little tricky. Uh. Okay, and then we climb. Okay. Gotta get used to that. Oh, that looks like. Um, in Oxen Free One, that little section two. Oh, wait, wait up a minute. There's a bench over here. Yeah, I see it. Can we just take a quick second? Yeah. Is he getting tired? I just need to rest my feet. Um, I sound no, like let's maybe, let him rest. But... Uh, yeah, that's fine. We can take a minute. I am the same way Jacob. <laughs> I could use the break too. Yeah, exactly. Oh, thanks. Just till my toes stop throbbing. <laughs> Honestly, I really can't. I'm already getting physically uncomfortable just sitting here for 20 minutes. Turned out to be a really oh. nice night. Okay. Oh, I get to get comfortable again. Oh, my dad and I hike these woods. <clears throat> okay. My uh, dad and I walked these woods before. I was five or six, and we were coming up to the entrance to the, uh, the park, and I saw something off in the woods, something that... I just remember it made me slip and fall a little. <laughs> my dad, he, he pulled me back so I wouldn't go off the ledge. He hurt my shoulder and I had to go to the oh. hospital. I've actually, <laughs> I've actually always hated these woods. I didn't even remember that I hated them until now. Can I sit? Okay. Yeah, huh. these woods will kill you if you let them. Oh, what does that mean? You're no kidding? No. These woods will kill you? What does that info, mean? Jacob. Oh, you know, we have a pretty big black bear population. So okay. I feel like there's something you're not saying stuff. there. Other stuff there. Yep, there All it is. All right. Thanks for the stop. Let me catch my breath. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, before these massive amounts of stairs. That was good talk. Good talk, Jacob. So... I don't know if it's true or not, but one of the options we had before is saying that we weren't close with our dad. Maybe that's true, or maybe because we didn't select that, it's not true. I'm not sure if that's a choice consequence thing. But if not, and like we're not close with our dad, we hike these woods, He grabbed, we saw something in the woods that caused us to slip. That's really interesting. It's been an hour already, okay. All right, we're getting close. Just over the crust, there should be a clear enough spot for the transmitter. Is this, are we climbing this? Ooh, I think we are, but let's check this out first. Hours, sunrise to sunset. Used to be open okay. to like 10, but someone spotted a bobcat a couple years back. Okay. Limited the hours. Can we open Closed. It? Yeah. Locked. And locked. Damn it. Damn it. The hell do I do? Huh. I don't know another way around. Maybe we should call Evelyn. Tell her we're at a bit of an impasse. Wait. I'm confused because we already know that it's closed. Sorry this turned into a bit of a headache. 
I totally forgot that they locked parts oh. of the park up after hours. We just gotta climb. But, okay. Nope, that's the radio. Let's call Elvin. The gate is locked. I screwed up. I don't think hey, I screwed up. Hey, uh, Evelyn, this thing is closed. Or locked. The way to the summit. Closes at sunset. Okay, uh, that's not ideal. See if you can, um, uh, I don't know. Stupid small town crap. I'll bet the bars close at like 2.30 in the afternoon. <laughs> we gotta get that thing placed up top, so, uh, get creative. Over and out. Cla we saw we could climb. Oh. Looks like the lock's on the other side. Okay. Huh. I'd say let me boost you over, but that barbed wire says otherwise. Let's check it out. I'd rather avoid tetanus, so no climbing this one. Don't forget about MRSA. Um, yeah, I don't know what uh, that is. What the hell is MRSA? Oh, it's just, just another uh, infection. Another kind of infection. <laughs> He's cute. I like Jacob. Okay, we already did see that we could climb this, so I'm assuming this or this nothing. Is, yeah, this oh, is what well, we're doing. That works too. It is a uh, a proper climb, though. Coming with? Mountaineering isn't exactly on my CV, so uh, knock yourself out there, champ. Oh my God! Did you see that? Uh, f figuratively. Uh. Oh come on! It's fun. Good challenge, you know. I'll happily take your word for it. I don't find Come any of this fun. after your top side? I would not ever, ever do this. I have horrible balance. I seriously horrible balance. Oh my god, what, what are we gonna do? What? No, that wouldn't work. Oh, this makes me so happy, though. <laughs> it's pretty. Hmm, forgot how pretty it can be up here. Can we walk him? Okay, I guess I can't, like, just talk to her. Oh, let's talk to some other people. Um, is... Is anyone here? Over? Hi, this is a pre-recorded message. You've reached the Kamina High School radio advice line. Oh. If you'd like to get some advice, please call again when the line is open. I will Listen later. Point one to tune in and find out when to call. Thank you. Have an oh, that's okay interesting. day. Let's do that. Eighty-eight point one tracks approved by Principal Haddish. Our advice line is now open, so bring on those questions. I'll happily steer you through these confusing times we call our lives. I guess it's Go open now. Go to channel eight on your radios or walkie-talkies and chat with me, please. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah. Okay, I guess we just need to, like, activate it first. Hey, uh, is this the Kamina High School radio station? This is Riley, first-time caller, first-time listener. Uh, can I get some advice? And we're also, Over. like, not in high school, so it's a little weird. Hey, uh, hi. Uh, yeah, what, uh, what do you want? Just general life coaching or, uh, something more specific? Um, will I be good at this job? Yeah. Will I be good at this? Am I gonna finally be actually good at something? This is so fun. Yes. I, I mean, I don't personally know you, but yeah, I, I think so. Here's some real advice, though. If you see three teenagers at the docks tonight, running around with radios, wearing masks, tell them Maria thinks they're assholes. Oh! Also, call back if you want to talk about anything. Like, anything at all. You're the first fresh caller in a week. Okay, I gotta go. Bye. Please call. Okay, that sounds terrifying and also, like, exciting and funny, too. Oh, I keep doing the radio. Okay, let's see who else we got. Oh, we can't say is anyone here for that one. Oh, I guess that's all we can do right now. Okay. All right, well, let's keep doing our actual Finally, job. are you at the summit? Over. Um, yeah. Hey, uh, Evelyn. Yeah, I'm at the summit. Over. Oh, perfect. Oh, I guess so, it was up there. When you plant the transmitter, you'll need to adjust it manually a little. Just fiddle with the dish so it aligns with the signal. You'll know when okay. it happens. Sounds good? Over. Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Makes sense. Got it. Great. Call me back if you get confused or anything. Over and out. Sure. Now, I bet we could do it ourselves, maybe? But, like, oh, let's... Hey, you made it. Yeah, let's let Jacob in. Good job. Um, you had doubts. It and wasn't what? easy. No. You doubted me? Not for a moment. 
You don't need to be rude awesome. to Jacob. Thanks. He's a cool guy. No Up problem. we go. Well, you grew up here, right? You ever buy that story what? about Edwards Island? About the, the submarine that went down near Fort Milner? The USS Kanaloa? Mm-hmm. Which story? Let's just say which story, just uh, in which case you story? haven't seen the, the USS first Kanaloa one. was the only American submarine down in enemy combat in American waters. It happened right off the coast of Edwards Island. 1943, during World War II. But, uh, you know, some people don't fully buy it. What do you mean? Uh, don't buy what? What do you mean? They think it's a lie? Well, some people say it was friendly fire, that we accidentally bombed our own sub. Why do people think that sounds thin? Do you believe? No, I want to. Uh, why would anyone more. think that? Oh, I don't know. Little discrepancies, little ghosts, things, maybe details, saying story, that's what's happened. Not hitting exactly right. Sometimes things just aren't what they seem, you know. Mm -hmm. hmm, a little metaphor for the storyline, maybe. Things aren't. Yeah, uh, but uh, well. yeah, if you're willing to bend your brain a bit, there's always the other, other story. Wait. Say what, Jacob? Other, 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 other. There's another story on top of us bombing our own soldiers. Do you believe in ghosts? Um, yes. Sure. Let's say yes. Some people, maybe even some people standing right next to you, think the crew members of the USS Kanaloa got lost on the way to the light. Jacob's one of them. Creepy joke. I'm a ghost. They should make that the story. Um, let's just say creepy. I'm thoroughly creeped out now. Thanks. I don't mean to give you goosebumps. I'm just trying to give you the back alley tour. <laughs> it, it, it makes sense if the radio wave strangeness is coming from there, right? That's why he wanted I mean, to bring that. Edwards Island is a weird place. You go there and it's like your feet never really touch the ground. Couple that with an at least semi-questionable tale of maritime disaster and you have yourself the recipe for a proper ghost story. Hmm. Yeah. Dunno. Your mileage may vary, I guess. Let's stick with believing him. Look, I can believe Get on it. his good side. I've seen crap that's hard to explain. Impossible yeah, to explain, let's even. Just... So, hey, you tell me a down submarine crew haunts the coast of Kamina, I won't argue. You're kind, but let's be realistic. Hmm. But hey, ghosts, no ghosts, wartime accident, or a heroic defeat. At least we can both agree that it gets too friggin' cold out. Okay. Jesus. So... Ooh. He, my feet. I like him a lot. He he's like into right, the stories, but he's also a realist. Oh, agreed. I'm freezing. Not necessarily a realist, but just like you know, oh, grounded. Hey, a little animal burrow. In reality, That's cute, I guess. Yeah, uh, I'd steer clear. Skunks are, you know, a thing. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Guess can't. Okay. It's a little weather worn, but this is nice. They used to have one of those coin operated binocular things up here. Oh. And someone kept sticking gum over the eye holes. Really lost its luster. Yeah. Oh, whoa. See that? Over Edwards Island. <laughs> oh, that storm cloud looks nuts. <laughs> we don't usually get skies like this. Uh, yeah, yeah, let's do that one. That doesn't look great. Kind of foreboding, it's right? Edwards Island. Yeah, maybe. We might want to do this quick. Do, wait, what are we doing? Oh, yeah, we're doing the transmitter. So <laughs> like, I'm just over too here, excited looks to like see as it. Good a spot as any. Let's plan it around this area. It's clear enough. We're, I'm already okay. on it. Already on it, Jacob. Okay, so the transmitter needs to be adjusted manually. Just okay. move the, the thingy until the what's it connects to oh. a source frequency. Clearly, you're an expert. I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, to be honest, I really don't know what the hell I'm doing. Give me a second. I'm just like moving this thing around. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh, I see. Okay. Faster, faster. Slower. Okay, somewhere here. Oh. Uh, I think you just have to point it oh. so it catches the signal. No, I'm working on it. Yeah, it's working great. I uh, think. We call Evan Lynn what now? So what's uh, what's next? This was our only transmitter for the night. Back it in? 
Let's, uh, let, let's actually call Evelyn real quick. Make sure they're getting the feed. Hey, uh, Evelyn, we did it. We planted the transmitter. Looks good on our end. Over. Yeah, hey, Riley. Yeah, the readings just coming in now. There they are. The signal's clear. You guys did a great job. Thanks. Oh, uh, hold up one second. We're just okay. hanging out. This is a little weird. Uh, guys, What's a little tell weird? Me, what color is the little light blinking? Red. Red, red. Uh, Jeez. <gasps> oh! Wait, what is that? Do you see that over Edwards Island? Uh -huh. Riley, do you know? Is this. Is this right? Riley, what's going on? The readings are a little weird over here. Uh, Riley, is this normal? It's uh, reacting with the. Riley! Turn off the transmitter. Okay. 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 Oh, okay. Okay. What she said. I'm trying to. Nothing. I can't do anything. No. 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 God, I can't believe this. Oh, that's us. Oh, the portal on the left. Something's wrong with it. Oh, I was almost there. What is that touching it? Is it like? Oh my God! What? We're on the beach at Edwards Island. I can't move. I can't do Wait, anything. The, oh, there's someone here. I. Who her, is she? She did something. She, I mean, she I want to leave. <gasps> Mom, come on. You tell me all the time. Don't let the concerns of others concern you, right? Huh? Wh what? I'm gonna follow you, my child. Come in, Riley. What? There, pick up, please. Riley? What? Answer, please. Over. Are you there? I... Riley! It's the little <laughs> button on the left with the dial. Circling back. Evelyn, I need some time to process. Oh my god. Riley! Oh my god! Are you in the bathroom? <laughs> I need a little bit more time to Riley, process, I think. Pick up, please. <laughs> Thank you. Over. Next time on Oxen Free 2 Lost Signals. I've had time to process. Oh! What is happening? Oh. Everything's calm now. I could take a breath. Whoa! Oh! Whoa! Oh, 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 whoa! Oh. What? I'm scared of you, but I'm following you. Is that a good thing? Is that a good thing? Is that a good thing? <laughs> is that a good thing? <laughs>